Hey guys, welcome to the channel. I got a Power XL air fryer for Christmas, so look out y'all, because we're going to get ready and make a bunch of new recipes for our channel. And this one right here is our pork chop recipe, and I just want to tease you right off the start here. All right, let's get to cooking. All right, so here is the Power XL air fryer, and we're going to swoop right on down, and I'm going to show you the front of it. Right there is the on and off button, and on that side is your temperature, and on the other side is how many minutes you're going to need to cook your food. Okay, now these are ribeye pork chops. They always turned out really tender, really good pork chops. That is the olive oil right here, y'all, and here is the famous Dave's rub, rib rub. But you can put it on everything, and it's so good. All right, so I poured some olive oil up here, and I have really got to go in search of a sprayer for my olive oil. I need a sprayer bad, because all this time I'm having to do this, I could already been done. Spray, spray, and be finished. So that's going on my list of wants. All right, let's put the rib rub on these pork chops. And I, I kind of, you know, season them up quite well. I love that seasoning. That is my favorite. If y'all have some seasonings y'all would like me to try, um, just send me a little note and I'll get you the address to send me some seasonings to try. And I will do it with some videos up here. I'm just salt and peppering now. And I was showing you my Tupperware salt and pepper shakers. I love those things. So I flipped the pork chops over. And I'm going to do the same thing all over again. Just brush those things with your oil and put your seasoning up there and you'll be done with that. You know, you got to have the oil up there for your seasonings to stick to your meat. So don't forget that. All right, we're going to have all of that done. Like I said, you're going to put your rib rub on there or your favorite seasoning, salt and pepper. And then that's it. I kind of went fast mode on that for you. All right, here is the pan, the air fryer pan. And I'm using some spray. And it is a nonstick pan, but I am spraying the bottom of it. Can't you see all that mess just flying around? Lord have mercy. All right, we're going to place the pork chops in the air fryer pan. And we're going to put it in the air fryer. Alright, we're going to get this thing cut on. So we're going to mash the on button. We're going to punch it up to 400. And come over here and do it to 12 minutes. And mash that button again. That's going to make it come on to cook. You see that them dots going across there? It's now cooking. All right, we're going to come back at six minutes and flip them over. There we go. They look so good. And oh my gosh, I wish you could smell them. We're going to get them all flipped over and cook them for the last six minutes. I love this air fryer. Oh my gosh, y'all. I can't wait to show you more recipes with this air fryer. There we go. All right, we're going to shut it back up, and it will automatically come back on and start the final six minutes. So we'll see you in a few minutes. All right, the countdown has begun. Okay, here they are. The pork chops are done in 12 minutes. I'm going to take them out of the plate and show them to you. Here we go. Don't they look absolutely delicious, y'all? Oh, my gosh. Mm, I wish we had smell -o vision They are so good. And I'm going to get one of those cut right here in just a minute. But I want to turn the plate around and let you see just how good they are. 
All right, I'm going to get one cut for you. Hang on just a second. All right, there we go. It's cut, and I wanted to show it to you. It's very juicy inside. Mm, mm, mm. Y'all, get your air fryer. Get that thing a cooking. Get in the comments. Tell me what y'all have been cooking in your air fryers. And I'm going to have more recipes coming soon. Thank you guys so much for checking us out today. And we'll see y'all on the next video. And I am enjoying my Power XL air fryer. Y'all have a wonderful day and we'll see y'all on the next video. Bye now.